my dear student welcome to my online class who fare well by the grace of almighty for attending the class you should collect your textbook notebook and a pen and write down the key point of the lecture which will be the more beneficiary for your later practice our today's lesson is the fairy boat in a four lesson one look at the learning outcomes after we have studied this lesson we will be able to ask and tell about the problems and seek and give suggestion listen for a specific information and write an incident in writing look at the picture and answer these questions but look at the picture carefully and then try your best to answer this question question number 1 where can you find this kind of boat question number 2 why does the boat and carry passenger across a river question number 3 why do people use country boat question number 4 is this boat of a crowd question number 5 What may happen if a boat is overcrowded? Please pause the video, write down the answer on your notebook, and submit it to the Google Classroom. Submit to the vocabulary box. Very good. Look at the picture. The people using the boat, which is going from one side to another side, and the meaning: a motor vehicle flies on a river run by man that carries a passenger on a horse. That is. Very bored. Carries passenger in machine. Overcrowded. Look at the pictures. There are a lot of people on the boat. That is capacity. With the meaning, gathering of people. For example, citizens. Very boat is overcrowded with too many passengers. Fly. Look at the picture. This using the boat. People go from one side to another side. Meaning, travel between the two particular places. Look at the sentence. The ferry boat flies in a particular way. Shopping bags. Look at the picture. And meaning, bags used for keeping binders. So when we go to the market after doing the shopping, then use the bag to carry the goods. This is called the shopping bag. Look at the sentence. People use shopping bags for keeping binders. Who has ever crossed a river by boat? Teacher asks the students, "Is there anybody who has ever crossed a river by boat? There is anyone who has ever crossed? Ever means at any time, and cross means to move relatively from one side to another side. So there is anyone who has ever crossed a river, who has any time moved from one side to another side by using a boat." So one of his students replied that I have teacher said Samil. Samil said I have crossed a river by using a boat. And he also added that, and I clearly remember what happened on the journey. And I clearly clearly means without doubt, obviously remember, recap, rewind, remember what happened on the journey. 
journey. That is what happened means took place on that journey. That indicate to the persons that is the demand stage of the present day. Journey means dream. So I clearly that means I obviously without any doubt recap what took place on the trips. Would you please tell us what happened? The teacher of Jamil. Then teacher of Jamil. Do you please tell us what happened? And kindly we can tell us what took place on the journey. Okay, teacher told us, and it happened while I was in classes. That means the incident took place while I was a student of classes. And quickly was that day, people were coming back with their shopping bags, baskets in a hand, on their shoulders and heads. In the rural area, the local bazaar was located on the bank of a river. And after doing the shopping, and people returning back their homes with their shopping bags, carrying their shopping bags and basket in their hands, on hanging on the shoulders, and some of them was carrying on the heads. But they had to cross the river. That means there is no other option. Had to indicate to the mast. But there is no other way to cross the river. There is no breeze or any other alternatives. But it was not a big river. Though the river is very small, the boat could cross it in eight to ten minutes. If you want to go from one side to another side, or we can cross the river. If you want to go from one side to another side, within the ten minutes we can cross. So it was just after the sunset. The sunset means the time time of the day when the sun disappears in the western horizon. The weather is getting worse. The weather. Was getting worse. Worse means unfavorable and not suitable. The wind started blowing from northwest, and blow means to produce an air current. That means the wind started means again and producing the air from the northwest. And black clouds were moving in the sky. Black clouds were moving. Mob means to change place, position, or depot. That means change the place in the sky. Everybody was trying to get into the boat. There are a lot of people in gathering on the bank of a river, but they try their best to get into the boat. Try means attempt or endeavor. Get into means move into an offset. No more, no more. Please wait. Shouted the boatman. The boatman shouted. Shouted means utter a sudden loud voice to attract attention or animate. That shouted. No more, no more. Please wait. There is a lot of people on the boat. Please, no one will try to get into the boat. But nobody listened to him. What happened then? Jamil, Zeroni, one of his classmates. This is Jamil. What happened then, Jamil? What happened? What took place at the time? So Jamil replied, "With the too many people on the boat, the boat sank in the middle of the river." Replied to Jamil. That means there are a lot of people on the boat. The boat sank. Sank means descent or submerged into a liquid. That means the boat submerged into the water in the middle part of the river. Oh no! What happened then? Oh no! This also indicated an exclamation or expression of alarm, concern, resentment about a problem or error. What happened then? What happened means what took place at that time? Asked the teacher. Then. This is a middle line. Thank God, it was not a fatal accident. Why? Fatal means causing that or destruction. That means there was no that too. There is why this is not a fatal accident. All the passengers swam to the other side. Swim means to move through the water or to float. But some of them lost their things, such as oil, salt, and meal. Can say this a meal. Some will say, and some of them, they lost their things. What they bought from the market. Were you on the boat? Asks the teacher. The teacher answers Amil. Did you get into the boat? No, teacher. The Jamil replied, and seeing the boat of a crowd, it appeared for the next time. So I, when I saw a boat was of a crowd, it then I waited for the next time. Wait means to del delay the moment. And he replied to Amil. We have done the right things, Amil. Zamil, you did the boat one. An answer in a brief. A. Why did the boat sink? Where were the people returning from? What did the passenger have? 
with them. Why did Samir wait for the next time? Your homework is, if we have too many people in a place, town, city, what will happen? We will have to write down a paragraph based on these topics. Thank you for all. Bye for now. Stay home. Stay safe.